You could love Russell Means or you could hate Russell Means, but you could never ignore Russell Means. Rapid City Journal reporter Kevin Wooster has been covering former American Indian activist Russell Means for decades. He had a great memory. He would call you and tell you that he either liked specific things about that story or did not like them. And if he did not like them, he really expected that to be changed. South Dakota many years ago was known as the Mississippi of, of the North by Native Americans all over the United States. Native Sun news editor and publisher Tim Gallego says Means and the American Indian Movement helped bring about change on the Pine Ridge Reservation. But Gallego says Means' approach at times provoked violence. Some of the things that happened, uh, I don't think we'll ever get to the bottom of, we'll never really know the whole truth. Uh, there's still rumors. Still, Gallego says there's appreciation for how Means led the 1973 uprising at Wounded Knee. I respect that the Russell for the courage of his convictions. He, he uh, found something he could believe in and he stood up for it. He did not want to give up the things that he had, the power of speech. If that was what radical treatments meant to try and save his life, that he would rather die and be able to speak than live on without the power of speech. Taisha Walker, Coda Territory News.